If you're looking for a cheap MT, head over to AEO and use code code for a discount at purchase. Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy JR and y'all boys know I'm back with another banger. And in this video, I have one of the best working badge glitches on NBA 2K20. This glitch is very similar to the far NBA 2K19 badge glitch that is still that you can still do. Um, so yeah, man, make sure you guys take advantage of this glitch because it will help you guys get your badges extremely fast. Now in this footage, you guys are going to see that this is going to be on a 60 overall. So if you guys have at least your player up to 85, then you're, you should be able to get way more badge progress as well. And also shout out to it's your boy Sam for letting me use his clips. You guys know I'm on Xbox and this glitch is currently for PS4. Let me know if you guys want me to see if it'll work on Xbox. I'm not 100% sure if it will or not, but let me let me know if that's something that you guys might want to see. But with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get right into the video. All right, so to start this glitch off, the very first thing that you guys are going to want to do is go over to your options and settings and then change your quarter length to 12 minutes. Make sure you guys put your quarter length on 12 minutes because you guys want to play as much as possible, especially if you're doing this on a new player. If you only play on five minute quarters, then you might not get that much playing time. Next, what you guys want to do is look at your schedule and sim to the team that's going to be the easiest game to get the most rip. So just go to the worst team that you see on your schedule. Um, in this case, I believe he went to the Pelicans. Now, what you guys want to do is go ahead and let this game load up. Alright, so with this glitch, you can do this whether you're a starter or not, it doesn't really matter. But you guys want to go ahead, get subbed into the game. Now, the key with this glitch is you guys want to be able to play all the way until the fourth quarter with like 10 seconds left or so. Like I said, this is like the NBA 2K19 badge glitch, which was super fire. Now, like I said, you guys, um, if you're doing this on a brand new player, then you guys might not play in the fourth quarter. So to prevent you from getting subbed out the whole fourth quarter, what you guys can do is you can like foul, like get five fouls in the first half, and then that will allow you to play more in the fourth quarter if that makes sense. But whenever you're, you're in this game, you guys wanna ball out and get as much bass progress as you possibly can because you're gonna be able to get the same bass progress every 24 hours and it's just a super far and easy way to get your badges without having to play my career. Um, so, like I said, you guys wanna ball out and get as much bass progress as you possibly can. And then you guys wanna play the game all the way through until the end of the fourth quarter. All right, so like I said, what you guys wanna do, go crazy and get as much bass progress as you possibly can. And remember, this is gonna be on a 60 overall. So if you guys at least have your players overall up, then you should be able to get way more, you know, bash progress than what you're about to see right here. But once you get to the fourth quarter with like 10 seconds left or so, what you guys wanna go ahead and do is save and quit out of the my career game. And then what you guys wanna do is go ahead, load back into the NBA 2K20 main menu, and then close out the application. And then you guys want to go over to your settings tab and remember you're, you guys are going to need PS Plus or a USB. Go to settings, go to application, save data management, and then go to save data in system storage. Once you do that, go ahead and upload to online storage if you have PS Plus or if you have a USB, go ahead and hit copy to USB storage device. Then you guys want to hit NBA 2K20 from this screen right here. Now, what you guys wanna do is go ahead and copy over the very first file that you see. So in this case, this is my career 005, and then select on that file and go ahead and hit upload. Next, you guys wanna go ahead, reload the game back up, and then select on the player that you're currently doing the glitch on. And then you know it's working if whenever you reload the game back up, if you get put back at the save point that, I sh that you saved at, at the beginning of the video. So once you load back into this game, what you guys wanna do, as like I said, it'll put you back at the save point. And then now all you guys want to do is go ahead and let this game run out and you'll get your badge progress. So you guys are going to see right here, um, you're going to get your my points, you're going to get your shooting, finishing, whatever you guys went for, and then you're going to get your VC as well. But as soon as your VC loads up, all you guys got to do is go ahead and close out the application. Once again, as soon as your VC loads up, just close out the application, go to settings, application, save data management. Go to save data in online storage. 
And then this time you guys wanna hit save data on USB storage device or save data in online storage, whichever one you use. And then you guys wanna go ahead and hit download to system storage. Select on the NBA 2K20. And then go ahead and reload that my career file 005 back up and then hit download. Now what you guys wanna do after that is come back 24 hours later reload the same game back up and you'll get the same bash progress over and over again.